Greetings, entities and guardians. My name is Hyper Himes, and welcome back to Kick Run Kingdom. Let's just get this out of the way because I'm happy. Because you know what this video is going to be all about? It's going to be the first time where I do a video where, before I even officially pull them on a Kwanko, I can actually do a, a plumbing video where I talk about the quote story and, uh, you know, using them in battle. Why? Well, I don't even need to use the gacha because check this out. Looky. Day 10? Oh, 500 Rainbow Cubes. Cool. And Day 10 Final Reward Stormbringer. Look at this. Oh, that's cool. You know, I just realized for some reason. Did it? Oh, no. It's because we got to do the animation. That's why. That's why. Uh, you've met Stormbringer Cookie. Well, don't we have to uh, unlock her first? Or does she just already walk around? Did she? Huh. I'm going to be honest with you. I thought I would see, like, the cool animation. The but... heaven splitter parts the skies. Look at that background. Look at that. Look, look at that background. That background is so cool. That you get it for, get it for free. For free! For free! I don't even know what to say. Oh my gosh. And someone finally replied to me on WhatsApp. Of course, right when I start recording. So, uh, it, wouldn't be, it wouldn't be a kick-around video without me hearing a plumbing notification message. Anyway. Uh, whew, anyway. I'm sorry. I'm just still coping with all this. Oh my gosh. Okay, so obviously what we're going to be doing here is we're going to be doing a quote story and like an analysis video like on the new cookie. Specifically Stormbringer because well, she's new here. So why not just find out where she is? Uh, that is uh, somewhat entirely different. Uh, I want to get all those jellies actually uh, Let's just go ahead and locate her on the dashboard because what we usually do here is for these videos I'd like to go ahead and just you know gander the cookie and just see what she says uh, See what her skill is see what her story is like and then after that we go ahead and you know Use her in battle and see how good she is because I'm gonna be honest with you. I really want to use this cookie I love I gen probably one of my top five favorite cookies in this game. Like, if I'm talking about like special cookies, like legendaries and stuff, the only one that could probably top her is golden cheese. But sheesh, really good. Anyway, I'm sorry. I, I I'm putting some stuff up just in case. Uh, where are you? How the plum did you start working on that? I never sort. I never designed you to working on. Wait, are you? When did? Why the plum? No, let's leave that someone else. Like Sea Fairy, she, you, use your hair to water it. Uh, but of course, uh, where are the plum? G oh, you're right here. Uh, well, I also need to make this like certain. Unfortunately for these videos, I usually don't read comments primarily because I want the video to focus on the cookie. However, if you still want to leave your questions and comments down in the comment section below for me to read on these videos, then feel free to do so. It could be a random question, a random comment, a random fact, something about me, something about the game, something entirely different. It doesn't even matter because as long as we're having a fun time at the end of the day and we appreciate being around each other from community to creator and creator to community, then that's what matters the most. Also, I originally was going to do the second part of like, you know, the whole uh, heaven splitting lightning thing storyline. However, since this was coming up, I knew I just had to do a video on this. So let's see some of the quotes that this uh, sweet little missy has to say. But actually, before that, before that being said, what do you look like? Just Okay, well, when you hold her up, she gets really pissy. <laughs> she just like hates you. And if you put her down, just elegantly like floats down on this like patented parachute pants of hers. Like seriously, just like floats. She doesn't even look like she's walking on and she's just skipping on lightning. She's just skipping on lightning, of course. Also, I want to see what it looks like when you just, like, sit down normally. Just want to see how that looks. Just, you know, just the hair just casually just on the back as she scoots forward on the bench. And the aura of, like, that fucking ribbon thing that's just around here is just still elegantly glowing. And she's running towards Rebel. Rebel, you better get all the way. Okay, Rebel's all the way. Unless if you're trying to, like, get back into heaven by just running over this log. If that's the case. <laughs> she's caring for the sugar gnome. She cares. Anyway, let's get you over to a little bit more clear area because I do want to check out what some of your quotes are, but I need to... Why the pub won't let me... Like, there. Sheesh. Don't know why it's, like, being so much of a hassle for me. Anyway, let's see what some of the stuff that you have to offer, even though you're hunting... Oh, you're hunting. <laughs> what? You are running with the Heaven Splitter right now. I can go anywhere in a blink of an eye. I mean, that would... Honestly, that makes sense because you know how fast lightning can be. Or thunder. Oh, it doesn't matter, they both come from a storm. But let's be honest, makes sense. Though, then again, I only see you just kind of running all over the place. So, could you imagine if she just, like, randomly teleported somewhere? I would be... I would be shocked, but I also wouldn't be surprised. I can go anywhere in a I, blink of an eye. I know that. You may speak. What was that? I can go anywhere in a blink of an eye. I didn't even say... I didn't even press that. I, I, why are you going to tell me that I can speak, and then you instantly interrupt... Excuse me? I swear, she she makes her own rules, and I don't even know how to, like, talk about it. Scoot you over here just so I could see you more. Have you no shame in gazing upon me? Why would I? I mean, it's not like I'm gazing into the sun. I'm most likely, like, gazing up at the storm clouds. Of course I would admire you. Are you kidding me? My strikes are as fast as lightning. Gee, I wonder why. Maybe it could be because you have literally a lightning-based weapon. 
And, okay, now she's just relaxing, eating it. What, what, is she, what is she eating? Is that some sort of a rice cake or something? She's still something for moon rabbit cookie? What's going on there? You may speak. I already am. You dare covet the pure skies? I probably couldn't. Like, I could let- I could barely get up a ladder. Upon me. You- you are really interrupting me a lot, which to be fair, I kind of expect that from you. And I- and technically it was me who called upon you because, well, I got you for absolutely- I- you costed nothing for me to get, so that's awesome. Who called upon me? Uh, I did. Know your place or face my wrath! I mean, to be fair, I wouldn't be surprised if you somehow crashed my game. Just like a hard enough crash of lightning and then I just die. The sky sees all! Well, I mean, yeah. Look. Look, it's literally above and to the side of the kingdom. It literally does everything. I should probably claim some of this stuff, but I'm too focused on trying to see look at this exciting new cookie. I'm just so ex like I'm just sheesh, I love this. I love this is great. Amazing, I love this. Okay. Anyway, back to this. Have you no shame? You may speak. Yes. Who called upon me? Have you no sh the sky know your place? Is that or there's face my wrath. There's nothing gotta be there, other than like the main story, there's nothing gotta be more quotes, right? On just the, the kingdom page, not the menu screen. I am the sky, and the sky is me. I mean, I'm not saying you're wrong. I'm just saying you're the embodiment of the sky. I don't think you're the sky itself. Actually, technically, I think you are. Because you're technically, like, one of the... You're not even one of the deities. You're just, like, the straight-up goddess in there. So, you know what? I can't really judge. And you just happen to, like, strike that at me. So, I should probably watch my wording. Have you no shame yeah. in gazing upon me? Uh, Karamoshi, you should probably move away from that. I'm pretty sure you might get striked by lightning. Upon me. You dare covet have you no shit? Is there any more? Dare. I am the sun is brighter than a flash of lightning. I mean, on Earth, yeah, but have you ever heard of something called a Kazar? Well, I think it's called a Quasar because it starts with a Q, but you know, it's the brightest thing in space, but then again, space does ascend the sky, so I uh, have to talk to Xylotel Nova about that one. <laughs> I don't know. The heavens might know no bounds. Well, yeah, that couldn't be more farther from the truth, and by that, I mean that's really truthful. I don't even. I don't, did I just, like, double, like... I don't know even what I'm trying to say. I'm just saying, I'm just trying to say that's honest. You may speak. Yeah, sure. I can go anywhere and my strikes are... I am the sky. Know your place. That might be it for the quotes, at least for the overworld, I'm pretty sure. None is brighter than... None is brighter than a flash of light. I'm pretty sure, at least. You dare come... The heavens might... The sky... The heavens... Who called... The heavens... Know your... You the sky... I'm just gonna spam speak. tap at this point. Uh, but if she does have more quotes, we can actually check it out on her main menu page, as you can see here. If I go ahead and click her once... I am the sky... And the you sky see the little eye informational, like, bubble thing right there? I can just tap that. My lightning is imbued with the heavens... Obviously, it makes sense because you come straight from the sky. And let me just say, this background is probably one of the best round, best backgrounds I've ever seen for a cookie. I know it makes sense that she has her own because it's a legendary cookie, but sheesh, this is incredible. It's not like some place that seems like domed in, like inside of a little hut or something. It's straight up on a tall podium surrounded by literal lightning strikes and thunder blasts and all that stuff. You can even see the raw electricity coming from the center up there. Anyway. Speak your wishes. Be moved into action. Okay, here's what I want. I'm gonna set up a steel pole right on top of my house, all right? And I'm gonna connect that to like every single generator that ever exists. I want you to strike it and give me infinite energy. That's what that's what I want. If we're able to control where electricity hits, then we can have inf legitimately infinite energy. As long as I don't blow a fuse or something. My lightning is imbued with the heaven power. Sheesh, I'm gonna need a lot of generators if that's the case. I'm gonna need like in all the generators on Earth. And probably even more than that. Remain humble when asking a favor of the heavens. Well, obviously, when it comes to asking a favor from the heavens, you have to be nice. You're not just gonna be like, hey, do this thing for me or I'll I'll stop believing. And then that's how you immediately die. That's just a quick fire way and how to die. You think you're the only cookie praying to the skies? Uh definitely not. I know for a fact there are way more out there. And I'm only just one of the small little disciples. But you know what? I still wear it with pride. Let it be known. The sky is filled with life powder! Okay, I got a few things to ask about that, because if it's filled with life powder, does that mean when it rains, it technically rains life? Or maybe it's like, maybe like a Frankenstein thing, where like a thunder shock to a cookie straight from the heavens is gonna bring him back to life. If that's the case, I think we found a meaning of life. It's just, look up to the sky and you see the heavens. Straight up. My lightning is imbued with the heaven power! We got that. The rain! And wind all move at my bidding. Well, because they're uh, they're based around the deity, the cloud deity, the wind deity, and the rain deity, which 
It makes sense because they all do their own thing. And basically, and this plumbing goddess of the plumbing above heavens just controls them just to do whatever she wants. Which, by the way, just for this little design detail, I love how, like, the arm shows, like, the little lines of electricity going up her. I don't know, it's a small detail, but it, it's it's still insane. The rain, cloud, the heavens split and parts the skies. Trust me, it's cut, it's cut apart more than just the skies. It's that powerful. Let it be known. Let it be known. Yep. You dare call upon me? Hey, it wasn't me. I Well, I mean, technically it was me, but I waited ten days for this, and I wanted it real bad. You dare call me? You dare, oh. you dare, you dare, Yes. You think you're the only feel the power of my heaven splitter. I'd rather not because I don't want to see heaven. Anyway, I'm going to go over her story, go over what her skill does, and use her in battle. And I have a pretty interesting way of how I'm going to do this. But of course, I need to ask a common question of the day to all of you, which is pretty obvious. What is your opinion on Stormbringer Cookie? Because let me tell you right now, she's up there. She's up in, like, probably, like, my top five favorite kickies of not even just Kingdom, but probably all time, just because, you know, design aspect alone, how her story is. I don't even know how she works in battle, but she hopefully should be really good, but also the voice actress, just how she looks, like, it's pure insanity. Like, literally one of my favorites. The only other cookie I would, like, compete, that would compete with her for, like, how much I genuinely love her is probably Golden Cheese Cookie, just, you know, because of the royalty aspect and how much lore, you know, I know of her, but, like, both are still really, really good. I'm curious to know what your opinions are on her, and there's probably gonna be some people going, like, oh, well, she doesn't add anything new, which I'm just, like, I mean, really? Like, I, I mean, I'm not sure if she, like, I don't know. I mean, technically, she did add something new. She added the whole entire electricity type. But then again, you can say, well, that's a kingdom thing. That's not the plumbing legendary thing. And I'm just saying, like, you know what? She needs a reason to exist, and I think this is now. Anyway, with that being said, let's go ahead and read up on her story real quick, just to find out what she's all about. Way up above, where clouds form and scatter, the Heaven Splitter lies sheathed in the heaviest cloud. This divine weapon is the very essence of Stormbringer Cookie herself. Forged from the lightning that first struck Earthbred, legends say that the Heaven Splitter can cut anything into two. Its powers are so mystifying that it once split a huge tower and even created day and night by slashing through the skies. Then, Stormbringer and Kiki gathered life powder and brought the deities of rain, wind, and clouds to life, thus creating the sacred cycle of life powder. This Kiki may sometimes laze around munching on candied clouds, but whenever someone challenges her power, she wields her heaven splitter high, ready to unleash her wrath. Be careful of what you pray to the skies, as even an inkling of arrogance will send Stormbringer Kiki to strike down with her lightning bolt. So really, you just don't, don't, don't mess with her. She's listening to everything. At least when you're like praying up to the skies, because if you day, if you say one wrong thing, I'm sorry, you're, you're just ash at that point. You're dead. Anyway, with that being said, she also has the skill called Lightning Blitzstorm. Which, is this going to be a long skill? Oh yeah, that's pretty long. Oh boy. Stormbringer Kiki, the ruler of the skies, and Lightning becomes supercharged when her crit percent... Uh, oh, yeah, wait. Becomes supercharged when her crit percent exceeds a certain percentage at the start of the battle, granting supercharged buffs to electri uh, electricity type ally cookies. When Stormbringer Kiki becomes supercharged, her regular attacks trigger chain lightning after a certain number of hits. Upon using her skill, she swings her heaven splitter, dealing damage to enemies and inflicting zap. Whenever uh, whenever allies uh, deal electricity type damage, it activates Stormbringer's aurora or aura and inflicts Stormbringer's punishment upon reaching a certain amount of stacks. Stormbringer's punishment deals damage and inflicts overcurrent on enemies. If enemies are inflicted with zap, they receive extra damage and their status changes to overcurrent. Stormbringer Cookie's aura resets when Stormbringer's punishment is activated. Interesting. That's a lot to take in. And of course, there's like damage with he Heaven Splitter and Supercharged and Superstar uh, Chain, uh, Stormbringer Aura, uh, Stormbringer's Punishment, Overcurrent. There's a lot to think about when it comes to this. But all I can tell is that basically she becomes supercharged after she has like a certain amount of crit overpassing what she yet generally has. And it buffs Electrotype Ally Cookies, I guess. So if you have Electrotype like uh, Twizzly Gummy Cookie or Black Lemonade Cookie, then that's going to help out a lot. And her regular attacks trigger Chain Lightning after a certain number of hits, which I'm pretty sure should just hit all enemies enemies or something because they connect and after she uses the skill swings the heaven splitter dealing damage to enemies and inflicting zap and whenever it deals electrocyte damage it activates their aura and inflicts stormbringer's punishment so it just it does even more damage and probably gives them a boost because of the aura and also the enemies are also zapped what which they also deal punishment damage because they also inflict overcurrent on enemies so it's straight up just like a definition of a chain reaction that activates one thing then activates another then activates another she sets a lot to take in but we definitely got to use her in a battle Anyway, I nope. Go anywhere in a My lightning is uh, I'm gonna go ahead and upgrade you real quick because you probably need the food. Uh, let's go ahead and do this. You call this a tribute? What do you, what, did, geez, did you want more? Okay, here. Not bad. I 
expect a bigger tribute next time? <laughs> Sheesh, how big do you want it? <laughs> you call this a tribute? Okay, here's more. <laughs> Behold my greatness. Okay, well, I'm glad that th that's apparently enough for you. The heavens roar with power! Well, it definitely seems like it, and all you need to do is just eat. How do you not get these levels when you're eating candied clouds, if I do may ask? The heavens roar with power! Look upon me with renewed awe. Mm, sounds like something that I'm doing. <laughs> Behold my greatness! Oh, that you know, sounds fair enough, and to be f mm, You know what? Should I? Now, what I'm gonna do, I'm throwing the 60 at you. Exactly, that's that's how it should feel. And you know what? We're gonna crank all these on you too. They say the sky's the limit, but to me, it is only the beginning. Don't worry, you're a 60,000 power, and we're gonna boost up your skill, why not? And just dump all of this onto you. All of this goes to you. What is that? That's over a thousand of those bags. Let's see, you went from 60. Oh my gosh, that's 200,000, 67,000 power. All right, let's use you in a proper battle. Let's go ahead and use you in a like a late stage. How about that? World exploration. Uh, what would be good for you? Uh, no, 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 not this place. We're gonna go to uh, Crispia and use you in a. Let, let's use you in a spark. Let's uh, this level is uh too easy for you. Only 125,000 power. Actually, let's go. Let's let's test out our real quick. Like it's only 100,000 power, but you know what? It'd be nice to test you out on something. And of course, I have mozzarella cookie here because I was recording mozzarella cookie facts. How high up are you? Oh, you're- oh, no, wait, that's golden cheese, I'm sorry. There you are, we're right there. One strike to split the heavens! Oh, you're gonna split more than the heavens at this point, let me tell you. One strike to split the heavens! Bow down to your sky god! I straight up just made you a god by yourself, just with all the XP I just gave you. Heaven splitter is roaring in anticipation! Mm-hmm, that's why you're about to storm through all these enemies. No pun intended, but also very much intended. I want to see you just destroy all these creatures. Just, just let, let me just see you just melt them. Let's see it. A little bit of a slow pace right here. Just the normal attacks. That just, they had a shield and they melted. Look at the thunder. What? Are you kidding me? I didn't even use the skill yet. I, use it. I get charged. Oh. So I just sit back and just do nothing? I should just sit back and do nothing. Okay. Mmm. How good does this taste? Oops. Here you go. Oh, and there's no more lightning there. That's that's a that's a that's, a, that's such a shame. Uh, but don't worry, when these next clubs come out. Uh-oh. It's it's this she saves it. She saves it. Oh, then more to come? More to come? Okay. There yeah, I I I'm I don't even have to I don't even have to touch anything. I don't have to touch anything. She just does it by herself. I know, like, she's still, like, ha like, this level was only half her power, but still. And she just did a whole swipe and just swept him. You've gotta be kidding me, dude. Okay, maybe I should try you in a little bit more of a tougher level, because I want to see how far we can push this. Victory is electric! Yeah, and uh, that's certainly the truth. That's certainly the truth. Alright, let's go to world map. Let's go, uh, what do I, dark mode currently right now? This is level four, that's less. Uh, let's try Timeless Kingdom. Let's, let's, uh... How high power is this level? 400,000 power? Should we do it? Should we do it? Mm, I think if it was regular, then I think it'd be a little bit more approachable. But, can we do it like Hall of Enlightenment? Like, final boss? Can we just try it? Uh, that's the 279,000. Let's, let's, let's try it. I wanna see how, how this will go. I swear, if, if, if this is an easy clean, I'm just gonna like, throw off my headphones right now. Cause I swear, how else? Let's just let a, let's, let's let a god just destroy and demolish everything. Let's just destroy these creators, and then here comes the th thunder cloud. Uh, nah, you're down. <laughs> just crushed their skulls immediately. Sheesh. Oh, okay, and here's these clubs. Oh, no, you're dead. <laughs> I didn't even need- I touched the skill once. I touched the skill once. Okay, then we, we could just let, let these poor saps just fight. Okay, she is taking a bit of damage, but she, she could still tank. Like, she could still tank for a good amount of damage. And she just does so many, like, she does, like, the basic attacks, and then she does the one lightning skill after her uh, initial skill. And then there's, like, the random bolts of lightning that happen with the storm clouds in the sky. Like, you've got to be kidding me, dude. 
Oh, let's get let's get rid of these clubs just to bash on through. Okay, cool. The whole lightning thing is uh, recharged again. Okay, uh, let's just speed up through this a bit. Hey, there's the cake tower witch. Hey, how are you doing? Uh, here's a whole lightning blast. <laughs> Dog, let's do it again. There we go. <laughs> okay, sure. And I'm pretty sure. Okay, that was a big beam of lightning. Okay, just keep on slashing. It's fine. Nothing to see. Oh, you have your own lightning now. Okay, I got you. How about your, your own lightning? Let's do our own again. And then just here we go. <laughs> I can't take this. I can't take this. <laughs> Victory is electric. Uh, all right, final verdict. If you... I think... If you don't get her for free within 10 days... By just keep making sure to log in over and over and over again to get her for free, you're you're getting scammed. You're straight up getting scammed. I don't know how to how else I can physically explain. You're just straight up getting scammed if you expect to just go like, oh, you know what? I could just get her casually through polls. You and you know the funny thing is, I can get her again if I want to. Why? Because there's still all there's like this the lightning bolts. Uh, I mean the daily gifts, but then there's the lightning bolts event where there's still a ton of these you can get. I have 7,004, and if I combine all these together, I can get like another like 1,500, getting up at like 9,000. So there's that, and I can also claim all the things from the past rewards too that can get me a little bit of extra of these loving, loving lightning bolts. So then you still have 17 days to do it, so that's just fantastic. I don't know what else to say. I'm just gonna go ahead and end the video. Just use her however you want to use her, but I think she's gonna be really good for some certain things. So with that being said, if you enjoyed the video, then please be sure to leave a like on it, and also share the video with your friends who enjoy my cooker run content. And if you enjoy my content in general, then why not subscribe and also hit the bell icon to be notified of whatever I do in the future. Also, down below in the description, you'll see links to all of my social media, including a Twitter post where if it gets 10,000 likes, I can get the kicker and YouTube stuff for absolutely free. A link to my Discord server called the Hype Knees Hub. A link to my merchandise where you can buy stuff to represent the channel. And lastly, a link to my Kofi where for just $1 a month, you can see exclusive content that you wouldn't normally see in this normal YouTube channel. But above all else, I will see you, entities, and guardians in the next video. Hail the Hype Knees.